Hello and welcome to White Glove Reviews. In this video we're taking a look at the Lever Gear Bit Vault. And this is like a keychain, carrying case, compact screwdriver, hold stuff stuff thing, all those technical terms. And I want to take a look at it. So let's see. It says, I don't know if you can see that or not, it says Designed in Greenville, South Carolina, and made in China. So, that's something, I guess. Anyway, let's open this thing up and take a look at it. Let's maybe open this thing up and take a look at it. I'm hoping this thing's kind of cool. But, it doesn't want to come out of the box. If you're interested, oh, here we go. If you're interested in this thing, I've included links in the description where you can. Oh, all right, pull me. I've included links in the description where you can find it on Amazon and. They run about this one. This one ran about forty bucks. So just for reference. All right. So aside from the packaging being the enemy, I got it out. All right. So let's see. We squeeze and pull, maybe. Sort of painful. We need instructions, but I'm going to look at the instructions. All right. So let's see. Thank you for purchasing the bit vault by Lever Gear. Bunch of other words. Alright, to open, pinch the sides and slide the tray out. Alright. So I pinch the sides, pinch the sides, slide the tray out. Oh. Alright. Okay, that's interesting. So let's see. There, right, care and maintenance, etc. Cleaning, other words. So it comes with. All right, so it comes with two bit drivers. Let's see what all this thing comes with. Uh, it comes with. Oh, I don't believe I didn't cut through that. It comes with an Allen wrench. Wait, that's not an Allen wrench. This is an Allen wrench. It comes with an Allen wrench, the belt clip, uh, screws for the belt clip, which I'm pretty sure I don't want to lose. The Allen wrench, the two bits. So for the bits, this side's in here. The wrong way. So I guess there's a right and a wrong way to slide it in. Mm, or is there? I guess you got to pinch it to close it. So the bits slide in here. So you can put the bit here for screwdrivering or here to get better leverage on a screwdriver. And then we have these plastic things, which I'm guessing are dividers. I feel like I'm pushing too hard on that. All right, so let's see. I'm guessing the divider goes in like this. All right, let me let me indulge in my being old to get my reading glasses so I can actually see what I'm doing. All right, so there's a little slot here, and a little slot here, and a little slot over there. So I'm guessing they slot in like that for that one. And uh, having glasses and not being used to them, I keep bump my glasses keep bumping the camera stand like that. And then this 
slots in here in this part. So you have dividers. Okay, so that's kind of cool. And then you can put the hex bits in there and then whatever else you want. Well, that's sort of cool. I kind of like that. And then it slides and one thing is you definitely got to pinch it to get it back in. So let's try it in the belt clip while we're doing all this stuff. See how horrible this is to do. I guess it is remarkably horrible. Alright. So all we're going to do is going to add belt clip as we delicately balance that screw on top of the Allen wrench. And wow, this is kind of a juggling act. And then we just start screwing it in. The wrong part of the Allen wrench. There we go, that'll be better. This thing in a little ways. Get it started. Grab the second screw and we'll put the belt clip on and take a look at how it looks with the belt clip. Hmm. Well, I think it's a little off. There we go. Uh, I didn't have it quite in the groove for the screws. Yeah, there we go. That's a ticket. All right. So, belt clip doesn't look too bad, I don't think. It's actually much easier to deal with installing, all, like, putting this stuff in than I was expecting. All right. I got it tightened down. I don't want to tighten it too far down. All right, so you got the clip here. You're gonna clip your keychain, and you got the belt clip there, and you pinch and slide. Well. That's interesting. Did I mess something up with the pinch and the slide thing? Hmm. Pinch and slide. Hmm. Huh. Okay, so it sticks a little bit. That might just be user error on my part, though. Or it might just need to get loosened up a little bit. And now, because of this O-ring, it's supposed to be what this was. This yeah, this compartment is supposed to be watertight. So maybe that's part of the issue too. Is the O-ring is causing it to stick a little bit. Hmm. Anyway, kind of a neat thing. I don't know how useful it is, but maybe if you wanted to have like a pocket, you know, just bits kit might be something cool to use anyway let me know what you think down in the comments and if you have any questions or suggestions you can also let me know down there if you're interested in finding out about this I'll include a link in the description with information where you can find it and if you've enjoyed this video please like and subscribe and I hope you'll have an excellent day